episode 41 of Ring Takes. We're going to be talking about all the heel turns that happened. <laughs> it seemed like this was the weekend, this this corner section of the week for uh, <laughs> WWE to turn everybody heel <laughs> and make some changes um, with Survivor Series on the horizon. We're also going to be talking about a potential Randy Orton return that has been rumbling a little bit there and get into a little bit of AEW full gear. Um, but I wanted to start off with continuing with uh, Luchadors here. Um, Santos Escobar finally turns on Rey Mysterio. We've been begging for this for the while for a while now. Um, Santos Escobar finally turning on Rey Mysterio. <laughs> um, everyone alluding to him leaving the brass necks near Logan Paul at Crown Jewel. Um, after a match with Carlito and Bobby Lashley, Santos Escobar basically let the beatdown happen. Um, Rey Mysterio comes out, chastises him for it. They get into a little back and forth, and wham! Uh, Santos Escobar finally turns on him and puts him down <laughs> and hurts Rey Mysterio. Uh, what do you guys think about the, the heel turn, and what do you guys think about what direction this is going to be going for Santos Escobar, LWO, and Carlito? Uh, what do you guys think? Well, I do want to say that there were two of us that were hoping for this, and one of us was just didn't want any more heel stables in in the WWE. So, <laughs> uh, so let's get let's get that right. Let's get that right. But like like I said from from the very beginning, when they when they put the LWO together, and Santos was a, was a baby face, and Cru, uh, Cruz del Toro and Joaquin Wild, when they first brought brought this whole group the group together, I felt like it, that they didn't have like the the swagger that they had in, in Legado del Fantasma and, and NXT. I mean, obviously, Rey Mysterio, with Rey Mysterio be, being the leader, obviously they had to take a, a back a back seat. But I just felt that they were their strongest when they when when they were heels. And I'm glad that this is finally this is finally ha- has um sp- sped up. Um, I guess apparently Ray, I read a report that I guess Ray Mysterio is set to undergo like his 30th knee surgery. 30th, Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> well, 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 I'm exa- I'm exaggerating, but you guys remember those commercial those WWE commercials? You might not be at home. I got surgery in my left knee. I got like six surgeries in my left knee. So his knee, so his knee, he got a bunch of knee surgery. So that's re- so that's why they sh- they shot the angle with uh with him stuck uh, behind the steel ste- steps and Santos kicking the steps. But it, you know it's it's about time. We we've been um we've been clamoring for for a heel, for a heel Santos. We we felt that that's when he was at his strongest in, in NXT. And like I said last like I said last week, those those um little nuggets that they were giving you and then and then you have what happened at the at the PLE with Santos visibly leaving the brass knuckles right in front right in front of Logan Paul Logan Paul and he, and I love the fact that Carlito br- actually brought it up on Sm- on Smackdown mm-hmm. see now we're seeing the WWE creative is actually is actually making these guys have common sense for once after all these year all these years mm-hmm. uh, where it seems it seems as though the common the booking yeah, was the opposite so now so now we're gonna we're gonna see that that tail Santos, um, whether or not that includes the rest of Legado del Fantasma is we'll see. Um, we we saw Zelina Zelina Vega's reaction to the whole thing, the the great acting she performance she put on with the with the mm-hmm. with the crying and such. So so it may take a while for them to it eventually get Bella. everybody. <laughs> Brie Bella, we got we got we got a, we got a strong start with Santos finally. <laughs> Mm-hmm. It's about goddamn time. Mm-hmm. <laughs> um, yeah, like I said, um, I think we've been wanting this from the beginning. Yeah, you know, they brought him in his baby faces, and we finally got the damn heel turn, which I'm so happy. And I, I actually find it pretty funny that it was Carlito who came in, like, you know whose fault this is. And it's like, oh, look at Carlito coming, coming over here, stirring the pot. Um, <laughs> and, um, I'm I'm all for it. I I'm just curious how they're gonna go about it. I think that's just the part because I think I don't know. Brian might agree or not with that. I think we all kind of just wanted the whole group heal, not the entire, but at least um, <laughs> Santos, you know, and the other two guys be that heel faction again. Um, I don't know where Zelina's gonna stand on this. Is she? You know, like gonna be sad and then be like, no, I'm with you guys. And does this mean that Ray is actually out? 
is the surgery for real? I'm assuming so because it looked like he was actually like, you know, actually like wrapped up and everything. So I don't know, but I'm really interested to see. I hope this isn't another like bloodline type thing where he beats the crap out of them and they just join him. <laughs> um but we'll see. I mean, I'm definitely I'm here for it. I wonder what if Ray is not in the picture, I just don't know. Is it just going to be Santos going against Carlito for a while or something? Or is he just going to legit take everybody out? Like, either you're with me or I'm going to, like, kick your ass. I don't know. So, um, hmm. or is he going to get a new feud with, like, another baby face or whatever? I don't know. So, I'm really intrigued to see in what direction this is going to go. Is If Ray is going to be in there or not. If he's not, I really don't know which way they're going to go, but we'll see. Um, and I think that's probably just thinking now that we're behind the attack, the, the heel turn. I'm just thinking that maybe that's why Carlito was brought back to probably mm-hmm. set up that feud between him and Santos and yeah. having Carlito and Santos battle. Because now we know that Ray's going to have knee surgery. He's going to be out for, I don't know, maybe it's something just a small procedure. So he's back by mania so they can bring it all together full circle. Um, but just looking at it, I just feel like that's probably why they called back Carlito. They finally found an angle where he can come in and actually um, get some ring work in. Uh, from Santos, this is something that he's basically need. He's not a he's not a baby face. <laughs> when you look at him when he was in NXT and stuff like that with his, his faction, that was badass. Like, that's what made him Santos Escobar, like the, the gimmick, the heritage, all the stuff they did, the attacks. It was a mob mentality that you kind of got from that group. So now that Santos has kind of did that and went back on his own, I feel like that he should obviously get his buddies, his tag team, Wild and Cruz, to join him and reform that. I think that's going to be the story that they're going to tell um, and see how that goes. Um, I don't know what the deal is with uh, Selena Vega. Um Obviously, she showed that she can hang on her own in the ring and stuff like that with her past performances and stuff like that. So maybe that's something that they're going to explore. Obviously, I don't know if she's going to turn heel. Um, they do have Electra Lopez down in NXT. She, I believe she was originally with the group, right? In she NXT. was. Yep. Mm-hmm. Honestly, yeah, you know, so I mean, if, group, if so. anything, if anything. Yeah, she, was, yeah, she was in it. She was in it. Yeah, she was there early. She was like the original. Zelina. <laughs> yeah, she was the original. Yeah, pretty much, yeah. Uh, woman yeah woman member of the group so I, I don't see why they couldn't just bring her up and have her formulate that um in terms of what carlito is carlito kind of needed something right because carlito came back he had the song change um they really we heard reports that they didn't know what to do with him he can battle santos escobar santos escobar they need something to rub off on each other santos already took out uh one uh uh latin star right one latin legend he can take out a one another one in carlito and they can kind of build that storyline over the next couple of months so it's going to be interesting to see where they go on that for sure um but finally <laughs> santos turned on him enough of the baby face enough enough of the smiles enough of saying like ray mysterio is my hero and all this other stuff enough of that <laughs> let's get to the heel tactics let's get this up um happy for santos then <laughs> yeah um do you there, think there's uh, going to be a future interaction with um, Santos and um, Dom? Oh yeah, for sure. <laughs> I, I think yeah, that's that's going to that's going to be that's it. Gonna I did say I wanted Dom to be the leader of the LWO. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I was, Mommy I won't let him. I did say that, and you guys shitted on it. So. <laughs> no, Mommy well, won't let him. <laughs> no. <laughs> well, well, I mean. If if Ray and Dom were still the central were still the central figures, then then I guess you can you you can kind of finagle Dom being the being the leader. But do you really want Santos to be like the second in command to Dominic Mysterio? Yeah, no. yeah you <laughs> nah, he needs to bring back the suits, bring back the gold chains, everything. Like bring everything back. The mask. Didn't he have the mask? Didn't he have the mask too? Took it off, I think, yeah. when he first what appeared. Was that off before then? Oh, no, no, he yeah, had the yeah, mask. Yeah, he debuted, yeah, yeah, he debuted yeah. with the mask because um, I remember he was in that cruiserweight tournament or whatever, and mm-hmm. then he won the tournament with the mask, and then he took the mask off and then mm-hmm. said, "I'm Santos." Yeah, 
Yeah. Yeah. Good, 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 yeah. Okay, so we don't need the mask. But um, no, that's great. I feel like this is a good change for Santos. Hopefully they continue to build him up and have him be a force to be reckoned with. Um, title opportunities, even for the tag team, um, Cruz and Wild, hopefully they get a tag team. They should be taken seriously <laughs> and uh-huh. get some chances there. So um, we'll see what happens with that. Um, let's move on to another turn, I guess. <laughs> Oscar and Kari Sane joined Damage Control. 